According to the philosophy of language, there are five speech actions. They are called actions because when we speak, we are acting. The five are requests, promises, offers, assessments, and assertions. Today I want to speak about assessments and assertions and the difference between the two. First of all, assertions. So we call a something an assertion when it's similar to being a fact. So this table that I'm sitting in front of is black, it's metal. I'm sitting outside, it's an outside table. That's a fact. Nobody in our culture anyway would disagree that it's a table or that it's black. I'm sitting on an orange chair and there's a yellowish, greenish yellowish colored bush behind me. In our culture, nobody would disagree with these assertions. Now, assessments are another thing. So if I say that this bush behind me is stunningly beautiful, you might agree or disagree. If I say this table is, um, I don't know, I could say it's the ugliest thing that I've ever seen. Or I could say it's, it's really stupid. Or I could say it's not very practical because, you know, it has little holes in it. And you might agree. Or you might not, because these are assessments. Now the problem comes in when we treat assessments as though they're assertions. If you disagree with me about my assessments, and I then argue with you, I'm treating my assessment as though it's a fact. Now this comes as a very huge problem in our world, in this culture especially, because we'll go to war over our opinions about things, not about the facts. We don't go to war that this is a table. We don't separate, we don't get fired, we don't get stonewalled. We don't cause relationship challenges over facts, only over assessments or opinions. And that's because we treat them as though they're facts. If we knew that an assessment, my assessment, was only my assessment and not the truth, I would not argue with you. I would not stonewall you. I would not disconnect myself from you. So my invitation, everybody, because I think it's perhaps the biggest problem we have in the world right now, is we treat our assessments as though they are assertions. And that's the source of many, if not all, relationship problems.